Hey guys, Andy from MCC Just Motos. I'm training this Pac-Man and my Royal Enfield Bobber for a brand new Royal Enfield motorcycle. He's coming right now to drop it off. Let's go check it out. Welcome to MCC Just Motos. <laughs> I'm trading the 1999 Bullet Bobber I got as a project, not running. It was actually in really good shape, just not running. I did a lot of time and effort to fix it. New ignition, new coil, new plug, new wire, new battery, new tires. Cleaned everything, got a new stator, and finally got it up and running. It's at the timing, and it runs and rides pretty good. I really enjoy it, but it's time to trade this off for something that was a little newer. All right, there's the Meteor 350. Some, also some other good things, I see them. Whoa, we'll have to take a look in a bit. Okay, we had the owner of Baxter Cycle, uh, Mr. Randy Baxter, come all the way out from Iowa to pick up my bike and drop this guy off. I got some goodies in there um, from Jeremy. So pretty excited about that. But I also got some goodies going out. So it's gonna go both ways. All right. Randy said he's gonna let me take a look at some of the bikes Inside, he's gonna turn the lights on. All right, cool. I do see a Norton there. That is 650 Commando. That's a nice looking bike. Um, Triumph, Speedmaster, is it? Old one, wow. Okay, oh, yeah. That 750 is nice looking. <laughs> is that the one you guys got yesterday? Yeah. Okay. That has a disc brake. Oh my gosh. Is that. They come with a disc brake? There's no way. Yeah. Oh, okay, and there's another Norton back. I can't tell which one that is. Oh, well, that's not Norton. Yes, it is. The it one is? In the very back is one that was just restored. What is that one, do you know? It's a 70, uh, okay. 2, I believe. So, no. I think it's 72. Okay. That's wild on the brake. Very cool. All right. Well, a little bit of eye candy for the video while we're getting here. Gonna say goodbye to the bobber, old peacock blue. All right, so I got a Royal Enfield dry bag here. It's pretty cool. It's wax leather. Um, and, um, but you open it up and it's a dry bag and it gave me oh, a whole bunch of shirts. I'm gonna go get the shirts and you'll see. All right, so there's all the t-shirts and the dry bag. There's just some of the uh, swag I got. I got a, a bunch of cool Royal Enfield shirts. Motorcycle shirts is a, a buff. Royal Enfield, a Himalayan, and then a, a Baxter Cycle shirt. Very cool. You saw some of the cool swag that Jeremy got me from Baxter Cycle, but it goes both ways. I got him some Moto Skates and Coffee t-shirts, a bunch of those, some stickers, uh, a very cool retro helmet that I got, brand new. So it went both ways. He gave me some cool swag, I gave him some cool swag. I think uh, we both had a really good deal all around. Um, I can't wait to go for a ride on this, tell you all about it, tell you my thoughts, what it's like. Um, that's gonna be a whole new series. Uh, if it's a good bike for beginners, is it good for experienced riders? Is it good for tooling around town? What can it do, what can it not do? This has navigation. Let's talk about all those different things. But in the meantime, let's get some eye candy and a quick walk around. All right, so there's a Meteor 350. I'll get the specs in a, at a different video. I can tell you it has about 18 horsepower and um, chain drive. I, I, I don't know the weight. I think it's close to 400 or so, or maybe a little bit less. One of the cool things that Jeremy said uh, when we were talking, he said, hey, you can really trade me any of your, any new 2022, 2023 of the 350s uh, for your bullet. Bob, I was like, cool. So I, I really went with the Meteor because I wanted something that was looked a little different than the bullets and the classics that I've had before. So this definitely has it. It's definitely more of a cruiser feel, cruiser look. Has a heel toe shifter, comes with a backrest, and um, very cool wheels. Single disc up front and rear. That is it. There's a single exhaust. Um, I can't wait to go for a ride. Uh, I picked a car that I want, the Stellar Red, he had one, and this is it. Um, it's actually, what I can tell you, before we go for any rides, it is really a bigger motorcycle than you might think. It, it feels bigger, but handles lighter, let me put it that way. Um, 
I have ridden one before and I can't wait to ride it again. And All right, guys, that's going to do it for me. Please like and subscribe. Let me know what questions you have on the Meteor 350. Um, do you think it was a good deal? Would you have made that trade? Uh, I can't wait to, like I said, go for a spin. A huge thank you to, to Jeremy uh, at Baxter Cycle as well as Randy from Baxter Cycle, the owner there, for driving it out. We'll catch you in the next episode and we're going to be driving this thing around very shortly. Thanks for watching. <laughs>